Yo, what's up everybody? It's your boy Floss, back again with another video. And today we're gonna take a look at the Soundcast VG5. Now this is a portable outdoor full range Bluetooth loudspeaker system with subwoofer. Now you can buy this on Amazon. I'll throw the link up in the description. The price on this one, 500 bucks. Now I know what y'all gonna say, 500 bucks, the price is pretty steep, but this speaker came highly recommended from one of my audiophile friends, so we're gonna put it to the test. All right, so let's go through the features. Now the speaker is weather resistant, you get up to 15 hours worth of playtime, you got a 360 degree driver array, you got a six inch down firing woofer, you got your auxiliary audio inputs. Now on the top, you got your capacitive touch keypad, now you can also pair two VG5 units together for true wireless stereo. Now on a side note, whenever there's a speaker that can be paired to another speaker, I usually get two, but lately I've been buying one just to see how it sounds, and if this one sounds good, then I'll buy another one and we'll put them together and see how they sound. But right now we're just gonna test out one. Now this supports high definition audio with APTX and ACC. Now you can connect via Bluetooth and NFC pairing. Let's see anything else. All right, your six inch uh, woofer. Now, this is 60 watts RMF total system, by amp configuration, class D. Now, this is Bluetooth, high definition, ACC, and APTX codex. Now, for the interface, you got your backlit, multimodal, capacitive touch of keypads. You got your onboard play, pause controls, volume controls. You got power, muting, Bluetooth, and your true wireless stereo pairing controls. Let's see, you got your interactive fuel gauge LED, indicates power, battery life, and volume. Now for the battery on this, you got a high capacity rechargeable internal battery with 110 to 220 volts AC adapter. Now you can play audio via, uh, you can play audio while it's plugged in or using just the battery. Let's see, technology, uh, Bluetooth 4.2 with eight memory slots. You got your Qualcomm True Wireless Stereo. And that's pretty much everything else we covered. Or you also get a USB power bank so you can charge up your phone and your tablet. Now, 500 bucks. Let's see if this is worth the price. Let's unbox it and see what you get inside. All right, so here's everything you get in the box. You get your usual books and shit. You get a battery pack. We're going to talk about this in a second. You get a 3.5 auxiliary cable for non-Bluetooth devices. Here's your plug. And you also get a little box with some other international plugs. Now, here's your speaker itself. Now keep in mind, this speaker is 500 bucks. I will say this, it looks beautiful. Look at the top. All touch capacitive buttons. Got your Soundcast branding. There's your Bluetooth, your true, uh, your true wireless stereo. Play and pause, power, volume up and down. And all LEDs. On the front, here's your NFC logo. This way you're gonna pair it up using NFC. Now you can't really see this, but inside you can see a big bass radiator on the inside. Now check this out, on the bottom, you got your little screw right here so you can mount this to a stand. And you see these four screws? Now if you wanna use the battery pack, you have to unscrew them and plug this battery in. Now I'm not gonna do that right now, I don't have a screwdriver on handy. That's the first time I ever seen a speaker that comes with the battery separate. Is that a good thing or a bad thing? We're gonna find out. Let's see, on the back of the speaker, you got a handle. All right, so you can easily carry it around. Now I will say this, this speaker is extremely light. I'm dying to hear how this sounds. This is actually lighter than the big blue party. Look, I, watch this. I can lift this up with one finger. I can lift this speaker up with one finger easily. Let's go through the back real quick. Let me grab a little knife. Now this is weatherproof. So on the bottom, you got a weatherproof flap. So there's your auxiliary in 3.5. There's your, uh, uh, your charging, charging slot. You got a USB slot, so you can plug in a phone and you got your reset button. Simple and straightforward. All right, so I'm gonna plug this in, we're gonna get it paired up, and we're gonna do a little sound test. Talk amongst yourselves. All right, y'all, so we back in. Now I got the speaker all set up, so now let's test it out. Now the side note, I was playing some music just now, and I gotta be honest with y'all, for 500 bucks, I'm not sold on this speaker. But we'll go through it anyway. Now if you look at the top, you got your touch capacitive buttons, backlit keys, they look real nice. All right, so let's take it over to some Soul Group Universe, max volume.
All right, now I gotta be honest with y'all. For 500 bucks, I am not blown away. Now I will say this, the speaker does have a lot of bass, but there's no highs and no mids. And let me give you a perfect example of what I'm talking about. Let me grab a JBL boombox. Now listen to the difference. We're gonna play the same song. Alright, so I'm gonna play two more tracks. Listen for yourself. Now the VG5 has a nice amount of bass, but no highs and no mids. Check this out. Here's the VG5. Here's the JBL boombox. Alright, now here's the VG5. Listen for the highs and the mids.
Now listen for the highs and the mids on the JBL Boombox. What I will say is this, the Soundcast, it does have a little bit more bass, but it's not clean. It has a nice rumble to it, but there's no highs and there's no mids. This is all bass. And it's not even that heart pounding, ground shaking bass. It just has a nice rumble to it. But the bottom line is, is this speaker worth 500 bucks? And the answer is no. Now I'd be happy paying three to 350 for this because it does have the nice touch capacitive buttons on the top. It does look nice. It's a nice looking speaker. But 500 bucks, that's a no, dog. Anyway, this is the Soundcast VG5. Hit me up in the comments. Let me know what y'all think about this. Shout out to everybody rocking with me on Facebook, Foursquare, Twitter, Google Plus. Shout out to all the Google gangsters. I see y'all holding down that Facebook page. Shout out to everybody hit me up on Foxer. And a special shout out to everybody rocking with me on Instagram. Y'all know that's where I'm at full time, 100% full throttle. And a special shout out to everybody rocking with the new stream on Sundays. Y'all already know, Stream Gangsters on deck. Get your drinks ready, no meat boys allowed. Oh yeah, special shout out to everybody following me on Snapchat. Flossy underscore Carter, that's where I'm at. And a special shout out to the notification squad. I'll see y'all in the comment section early. Hashtag salute. Oh yeah, one more thing. I almost forgot. Fellas, ladies, say it with me. All y'all haters, all y'all trolls, close your eyes and picture me rolling. It's your boy Floss, I'm out. Deuces. Spot, one to beam up.